another video so this is a different setting to what I'm normally filming I'm normally in front of the bedroom wall but today I'm gonna be doing declutter with me organize with me so that is why we're starting off in the position because the main aspect of the video is cleaning the wardrobes so I don't know if you'll be able to see but look at the state of those I'll bring you closer they're literally all the flowing like I can hardly even open them some are literally broke if you look at the state of this one that is literally a mess so yeah we're just gonna sort the wardrobe out together today and I'm gonna be going through it all popping some stuff on vintage cleaning it all organizing it all I always have this side of my wardrobe as well as that is literally proving the point to why I'm filming this video. I just have stuff everywhere. So they're just going to be touching. But yeah, I'm going to be doing this wardrobe too. As you can see, this one is the exact same. Literally, that does not even open. So yeah, that is the wardrobe. Also going to be doing these boxes up here. And my coats and a few bits under my bed i've actually kept under my bed quite clean so it's just like a few holiday bits that i'm going to go through i might do some polishing as well so wipe it down of the sides we'll see if i have enough time for that if not that's a weekend job but yeah that is today's video and i'm going to start off with the wardrobe because they need tackling the most I might start with this side because i feel like i always start with that side and then this side never gets done properly I don't think I've cleaned out my crop top drawer in like a year. So that needs to do it. And that's in this wardrobe. So we're going to start with, with this wardrobe first. And this wardrobe has four drawers of tracksuits. The camera is going blurry. This wardrobe has four drawers of tracksuits. One drawer of crop tops. A legging drawer an underwear drawer and then like a bits and bobs random drawer do you know that drawer that has just random stuff in it that has that so yeah that is where we're gonna start we're gonna start at the top with the tracksuits okay so first like i said we're gonna tackle the tracksuits so i think i'm literally just gonna pull everything out first and then go through it on the bed so i might regret this but i'm gonna like pile up like sweaters and tracksuits and then we can sort through them all okay so that is the first drawer empty that was literally just hoodies and sweaters so I'm going to slot that back in. Okay, so this is all of the hoodies and the sweaters. Um, I think I might go through these first maybe. Yeah, I think I'm going to go through these first. And then we can do the other three tracksuit drawers. Because these are just hoodies and sweaters. And one person does not need this many hoodies and sweaters. Some have still got the tags on. So yeah, I'm going to go through these first. And then I'll show you what I'm keeping and what I'm going to put on Vinted. One more time and one more night Without your hands, without me in your arms Looking back, I wonder why I didn't show you how deep is my love Okay, so this is my pile of hoodies. So this is what I am going to sell this pile. This pile and this pile are what I'm going to keep. So I've actually got rid of quite a few. I've got rid of one tracksuit and four jumpers, I think. So yeah, that's quite good so far. So I'm going to pop these back in the wardrobe now. Okay, so that is the top hoodie drawer done. 
that is all nice and neat now so that can go in neatly that is looking so much better already now we need to tackle the rest of the tracksuit drawers so i'm going to take all these out together and then sort these ones out out of the three drawers i wear i have a lot of tracksuits it's literally what i live in so i'm gonna go through these now try and get rid of some can't say i'm gonna get rid of many but yeah this is what i'm gonna go through okay so that's the first tracksuit drawer done i've got some beige ones and some brown ones in here these are from pretty little thing if you're wondering most of my tracksuits are so these are done now i can push this in nicely So that's the final tracksuit drawer all done. Okay, so so far, this is, I don't know why it's going blurry. This is all the stuff that I am selling or getting rid of. I'm going to tell my mum to go through it first, see if she wants to keep any of it because she loves her tracksuits. So I'm going to let her go through this. The tracksuit drawers are all nice and neat now. Finally, and now... This is actually the worst one of them all. This is my tops drawer, like my crop tops and everything. So this is going to be stressful. So I'm just going to put on a big time lapse whilst I empty this out. short sleeves here or long sleeves they're body suits they're shorts like t-shirt sleeves they're what i'm getting rid of and that's like a winter top so i've actually organized it pretty well but yeah now i'm going to sit and go through all this and fold it up So now we're going to move these into the drawer. One more time and one more now. Okay, so this is the top drawer all finished. How much better does that look? It literally is so much cleaner. So I've got like black and white basics here, long sleeved tops here, short sleeved t shirts there. The rest of the short sleeve t-shirts there with the bodysuit underneath. Got my bright summer tops at the back and then just some more basics there with some t-shirts underneath it there. That is so much neater. It's literally looking so much better already. Look at how much neater that looks. So the next job we're going to tackle is leggings. Now this should not take me too long. I do actually keep this job quite neat like in general, so this shouldn't take too long. Okay, so 
so that's it like enjoyed done like i said it didn't really take me that long to do and the rest of this wardrobe so honestly is this to sort out which I, will, I like to do the beauty stuff last and then the underwear and socks drawer so i'm gonna do that next and then we'll move on to the next wardrobe okay so next it is this wardrobe so first I'm gonna clear this bit like the bits that aren't supposed to be there and put them on the bed then i'm gonna straighten up the blazers and the t-shirts because they are a mess <laughs> as neat as I can get them because obviously tight space but I literally think I own every single coloured blazer on the planet so yeah that is that done next this drawer as you can see it's also jam packed this is like night out wear but it's time to tackle this So that is the drawer finished, like nail clothes, just got like basic tops over there, corset tops along the bottom, um, like shirts and denim tops and then dresses and skirts there. So that is that one done. Next is knitwear. So um, I'm going to go through this quickly, this won't take me that long so I'll just pop you on a quick time lapse. Okay, so that is that done. It's still a bit overflowed, but it's difficult with like knitted jumpers to keep to keep like it minimal because they're all so fat. So yeah, that's that one done. Okay, so the next jaw is jeans. So I'm just gonna take all these out again and see what I want to keep, and then I can just pop them back in because jeans again really easy to sort out. two pairs of jeans but as you can tell they're not gonna fit so i'm gonna sort the next drawer out which is also pants and see like what we can do with that okay so this drawer is full of like leather trousers and joggers and stuff like that so we're gonna go through this and see if the other jeans will fit in this drawer that's that drawer all done now as you can see the final drawer is my pajama drawer so i'm just going to quickly go through this and refold everything up because everything should be pretty neat underneath anyway finally done i just need to pop them jeans somewhere um but yeah that is the pajama drawer done okay so next is putting all the new items 
on my vintage. I have a massive pile behind the camera. Gonna move them onto my bed, take pictures and pop them on my vintage. So my vintage is always linked below on every video. So if you like some items that you see, make sure you go take a look at my vintage. I do tend to send out the exact same days you buy. If I'm not busy, I'm gonna get that done now and then they can go away. I was going to do the boxes on the top of my wardrobe like I said but it's nearly quarter past four and yeah my boyfriend will be coming soon so I think I'm just going to wrap it up here tidy like the actual little bits up in my room like putting these away putting the clothes away and I think I'm going to leave it at that I'm going to do the polishing and the boxes on my wardrobe probably at the weekend because this has took a long time longer than I thought it would anyway so yeah I do hope you enjoyed this declutter and organise with me and yeah don't forget to check out my vintage because I do have like over like 90 items already on there before all of this has already gone on so yeah I do hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.